Well, hello there. So you've got a Insta360 X3 camera and you've got yourself attached to your camera with the bracket that I showed you last time, a DJI wireless microphone. So what I'm going to show you today is how to set the best audio settings on the actual receiver, the DJI wireless receiver. So here we go. I'm going to unplug the camera. I'm going to slide the receiver from the camera. I'm going to put the camera down. <clears throat> so here we are. This is a receiver off of the camera. And just go through some of the things on here at the moment. You've got two little holes there. One is for your headphone socket so you can listen to what you're recording if you need to. The other one is the microphone output that goes from your receiver to your camera via the adapter. The other part here is a USB port and the other part here is an on off switch. Now I've powered on the, the receiver and what I'm getting in that little tiny window I'll show a picture of that in a minute. is it because I only shoot on my own there's only me that's uh, that's mic'd up so, uh, I might get my Sarah mic'd up or at least the dog mic'd up one day um, so I set this to mono you can set it to stereo you can use both of the uh, microphones if you want to um, so anyway so I've set that to mono and to access the main menu on this you swipe down and that will bring up the menu. I'll show you a picture close up so you can see what I'm going on. So at the moment it says mono. In the in the little window there that says I'm on one microphone. So you can change that to stereo if you want. That'll give you two microphones. But anyway, that's beside the point. But on this little tiny microphone, uh, rec the receiver here, you can set the gain of the individual transmitters. You can either set the right one higher or lower, or you can set the left one higher or lower. It's up to you. Um, but my recommendations are you set both of them the same until you notice that there's a difference. One person might speak more quietly than another, um, so you might have to change them. But I just leave them as they are at the moment. So we'll, we'll just go for the mono microphone. But also, you do have the ability to increase or decrease the gain setting of the transmitter which means that as you when you adjust it you adjust both of them up or down depending on what level you find more acceptable i find that 0 db is the best setting for the dji wireless microphone that's for the individual transmitters and the actual receiver set the receiver gain to 0 transmitter gains to 0 Anyway, to, to get to that menu, now we're in the the main menu by swiping down, we're in the main menu. Now you swipe left. I'll swipe this. It's quite, a, it's quite a fiddly little screen to operate. So anyway, I'm on here. So I'm now on the, the menu for the receiver again. I'll show you a picture of that and I'll put it in now. Okay, to access that menu, you tap on the screen and that will bring up the receiver volume levels so you can either move that left or right to give you the either increase or decrease the volume settings there so if you're happy with the volume settings that you've set um, you might want to go up to three plus three d to increase uh, thrust you might want to go up to three db to increase the volume um, but i'm i'm happy at zero so to come out of that menu you swipe up and you're out of that menu swipe Oh, come out of that menu. You swipe, come out of that menu. Told you it's fiddly, didn't I? The next one along is, is headphone settings. So that sets the volume of the headphones that you might be wearing. Next one along gives you the transmitter settings. So that will be on the microphone that's attached to your shirt. Tap on that screen. That brings up the transmitter gain. And you can also, you can also change it to low cutout if you want. There's other settings there like uh, recording microphone. Uh, it, actually, your, your transmitters, I forgot to mention earlier, your, your, trans, your little tiny transmitters will actually record sound as well onto their own internal memories. 
but I don't. I just use the uh, the camera to record everything. So anyway, let's go back to the the gain setting. There's a gain setting. Tap on that, and that will bring up a picture. I'll put a picture in of what I'm looking at. So I'll show you a picture of the gain setting, and then I'll show you a picture of the individual gain settings that you want to adjust. They're both set to zero, so you'll see that in the picture that I'm going to insert now. Okay, so you, you can see where you can adjust those levels. So I'm happy with zero. So swipe up, come out, swipe up again, come out, swipe up, come back to the main menu again, and that's it. Back to get back ready to go. So <clears throat> you just slide that back onto your camera, the bracket on the side of your camera. Make sure it's in the right one, not the headphone socket. There you go. That's it, ready to go. Ready to go out and do some recordings with your wireless microphone setup. Just make sure that's in line, the the cable. Make sure the cable's in line with the camera body so that it's not likely to be seen uh, when you're out filming. That's a little bit bent, so there we go. Straighten that up. Uh, there we go. So, the next video in these series will be actually me outside recording. And um, that'll be the first time I've been out with that DJI microphone on the Insta360 X3. I've always used... What the hell was that? I've always used the uh, Rode Wireless Go microphone. So, this will be a first. Anyway, right, so I'll catch you all on the next one.